And now closer to home, a tragedy out of Panola County near the Texas-Louisiana border. According to the sheriff's office, a deputy was shot and killed early this morning during a traffic stop. He is Deputy Chris Dickerson there on your screen. The suspect, Gregory Newsom, has been arrested in Shreveport at this time. A warrant for capital murder of a peace officer has been issued for Newsom, and Panola County is awaiting extradition. This is where Dickerson stopped Newsom, who was driving a Chevy Tahoe near the intersection of FM 10 and FM 2260, where Newsom allegedly got out and shot him. Dickerson reportedly returned fire, but was hit. He was taken to a hospital and unfortunately died from his injuries. Residents say they heard gunshots and called for help, but are still processing the unfortunate incident. It breaks my heart even more because these people are putting their lives on the line to protect us and then people are taking advantage of that and taking their lives. Officials say the deputy was shot six times with a semi-automatic rifle and that they believe this deputy did fire his weapon. And following Tuesday's devastation, Governor Greg Abbott issuing this following statement, quote, my thoughts and prayers are with the family of the deputy killed in the line of duty and with the Panola County Sheriff's Office as they deal with the aftermath of this unimaginable tragedy. He continued on by saying, we must never forget the solemn oath our law enforcement officers take to protect and keep our community safe. We must also ensure that the perpetrator faces swift justice. I ask that all Texans join Cecilia and me in remembering the sacrifice and service of the brave sheriff's deputy.